2007, everybody chose to love self-taught piano virtuoso Mika and his unique style of uplifting pop. I've had a bit of a weird journey to where I am today. I had a lot of problems at school. Uh, I was just one of those kids that was put down as the one who was going to be given hell. Thank God, you know, I did a lot of music and that's what saved me, really. Oh, as soon as I did my first gig and I walked into that theater, I knew that there was another way that you could live your life. I wanted to be based in kind of make-believe. Make-believe soon became reality for Mika and after a short stint singing opera, he brought his eclectic sound together on his debut album, Life in Cartoon Motion. People always are trying to get me to categorize my music or at least pigeonhole it, which is kind of goes against the whole point of the record that I've always wanted to make. With his flamboyant stage presence and four octave vocal range, it wasn't long before some famous comparisons were made. I actually think that being compared to someone like Freddie Mercury is an honor. As long as they don't start comparing his leotards to my fashion dress sense. After landing two nominations at this year's MTV Europe Music Awards, it looks like for Mika, there may well be a happy ending. I am surprised by a lot of the luck and a lot of the success that I've had over the past few months. I feel very lucky to be able to do this job. The